Hello students, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I am going to discuss in detail about the galvanic corrosion, which is also known as bimetallic corrosion. Whenever two or more different metals are connected to each other and jointly exposed to moist environment. Moist environment means along with the oxygen, moisture will be present. Then there is a probability for the formation of an electrolyte. So whenever two or more different metals are connected to each other and jointly exposed to moist environment, then it results in the formation of an electrolyte. With the result, anodic and cathodic areas will be created. That means it results in the formation of several electrochemical cells and thus it undergoes galvanic corrosion. So coming to the best example, whenever zinc is connected to copper and exposed to the moisture, then zinc being higher in the electrochemical series. So whenever if we compare the position of zinc with that of copper, in electrochemical series. Zinc is higher in the electrochemical series with the result zinc acts as anode and thus suffers corrosion. So, zinc being anode, it suffers from corrosion. And coming to the other metal that is copper, it will act as cathode and thus it will be protected from corrosion. So whenever zinc is connected to copper and jointly exposed to the moist environment, zinc being high in electrochemical series, it acts as the anode and undergoes corrosion. Whereas cathode acts as the copper acts as the cathode and that will be protected from the corrosion. So and this kind of corrosion is called as galvanic corrosion. And this kind of corrosion will be observed whenever if copper bolt is used on iron machine. So whenever <coughs> copper bolt is used on iron machine and both are exposed to the moist environment. Iron being high in the electrochemical series, electrochemical series, this iron undergoes corrosion, whereas copper will be protected from the corrosion. In the similar way, whenever lead and antimony solder is used on copper wire. So here how many metals are present? Three metals are present. One is lead, second one is antimony and the third one is copper. These three metals are connected to each other and they are jointly exposed to the moist environment. Then lead being higher in the electrochemical series acts as the anode and undergoes corrosion. This is all about the galvanic corrosion which is also known as bimetallic corrosion along with the examples. If you like the video don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.